I enjoy doing commercials. I enjoy doing them in between features. You know, it's just shorter, you're in and you're out, and it gives you a chance to kind of exercise, you know, different techniques and work with different people and different personalities and travel and see light in different countries. And, you know, it, it really does, I think, shape your career more when you start out earlier, being able to do that type of work. I tend to work with a lot of the same directors commercially. They have a sense of style, a look, generally the, the products that they're getting asked to shoot. The client or agency trusts them, so it's pretty good time on set for me. I mean, there have been times obviously where you have a more difficult client or agency and you really have to like be very specific with how you're lighting it and framing it and the days go a bit long because you have to redo stuff. But that's all part of filmmaking. I mean, there's always changes that need to be made and different personalities asking for different things. I choose wisely now because creative, I think, in advertising has, is at a slight standstill. There's not that much great creative as there used to be. It's still out there, but generally I like working in Europe for that reason because I think there's a bit more kind of personality in the spots that you guys have on TV than maybe in an American TV spot. If I'm better friends with the director and they know about the spot the moment that they're pitching on it and it looks like they're going to get the spot, they'll mention it to me and you know send me the treatment they wrote in the agency and you know we'll just loosely talk about it. But generally I'll come in after the director's already done their scouting um, and picked some of their locations, probably shared them with me while they were scouting it or sent me their selects afterward to comment on. Mm -hmm. And then I'll come in for the tech scout. So for instance, the commercial that I'm doing now in London, she mentioned it prior maybe a couple weeks before she was gonna come out. I came out after she saw the locations, but while she was kind of scouting them, she would send me pictures and just ask my opinion. But by the time I got here, they had selected them. Then I go tech scout them with my crew. And so we have only like less than a week before we execute and, and shoot. A lot of the time it's about your work. So agency generally, they have to approve DPs a lot of the time, depending on the product. Say if it's you know, a car spot or say it's a beauty spot, they want to make sure that the DP that's either the director's recommend or say it's an agency recommend, they're obviously going to make sure that their reel is you know, sound and they've done this type of work before and, and they're into that particular style. So I think just by going to my website or maybe asking my agent like, oh, can I see her beauty reel? They're generally looking at reels and stuff like that, but I wouldn't have to do any new project and put that together. It's mostly just what you've had previously and then you send it off. Sometimes the directors recommends enough and they don't really do much else. They just go on that word. I'm there to make everything look great, whatever that means in my department and even in other departments, you know. Um, I'm really big on production design and how to create depth and depth with light and stuff like that. So working with the art director in commercials is a huge thing for me. Any suggestion that we can all come to making the product or the whole spot or the movement of the camera or you know all that stuff better is fair game. So uh, that's one of my favorite things to do. And maybe that comes from doing narrative film work. You know, it's not just about like my department, it's about all kind of doing it so that it all kind of feels filmic and, you know, the product looks great or the person looks great or, you know, these days commercials are like little short films and you want them to look more like not a commercial.